Merry Christmas and everyone, and welcome back to the DUE Gym. It was requested that I do a Christmas showcase for either Skyrim or Fallout, and thus, I have done one. There are very few Christmas mods available for Fallout and Skyrim, but Skyrim has the coolest mods, in my opinion. Plus, I've only done one showcase for Skyrim, so here I have my second one. Here I have with me a total of five great mods for the holiday in Skyrim, so without further ado, let us get into them. Instead of waiting for Santa to throw himself down your chimney on Christmas, why don't you dress up and jump down other people's chimneys? Here I have with me the Skull Santa mod by MM137. This mod includes four pieces of apparel that you can craft at any forge. These include the Skull Christmas hat, gloves, rope, and boots. The Santa suit is designed to look like an in-game suit and can even be found in the Skull village on a specific NPC. The suit looks worn and dirty. It fits very well into the Skyrim world and doesn't break any immersion. It's very lore friendly and it's an all around great mod. Slay and reindeer are not included, however. Is Skyrim not festive enough for your tastes? Is it missing something? Maybe like colors and Christmas lights? Well, do I have the mod for you? I have the Christmas Lanterns by Manny GT. This mod adds Christmas colored lanterns to major big cities around Skyrim. They have a great variety of colors such as yellow, red, blue, green, and more. The creator covered a great amount of space. He added lanterns to the spruce trees in Whiterun, or just any big tree in cities to make it look like a Christmas tree. It's really cool to see, and I really appreciate this mod for what it is, even if it is a simple colorish one. I'm not sure if the lights actually give off any light space around them, like it lights any area, but it is really cool to look at, and it's nice to see. Is the moon too bland for you in Skyrim? It's Christmas! Add some detail to that moon, I say. Well, do I have the mod for you? We have the Skyrim Christmas Moon mod by Sarcastic Dragon. This mod is very simple, but creative. It adds Santa in a sleigh going across the moon with a dragon replacing the reindeer. It's creative and nice to look up and see. So, considering that Santa let those reindeer go for a dragon, where did they go? Well, they went to you. Well, at least one did. We have the Festive Flight, a magical mount for Christmas by Verteria is on the screen. A courier will find you in any big city that you are in, and you will get a letter and a golden bell. The golden bell does not exist as far as I know. I could not find it in all my equipment at all. But there is a note. Read the note fully, and you will be rewarded with a shout called Happy Thoughts. Equip and use it, and all of a sudden, a red mist will appear. Go up to it, and you'll find everyone's favorite reindeer, Rudolph. It works well. Rudolph flies you around while galloping magically through the air. It's a really fun mod to mess around with, and I enjoy it thoroughly. The reindeer, I'm not sure if the reindeer is already in-game because I haven't played this game fully, but it looks good for a reindeer. I mean, I like it. It's cool. It's simple. And the, it controls well, so what else could you ask for for a flying reindeer? Our last mod is a really cool quest mod. Best lead-in I have. This mod is called Insanity Clause by Raya Guard. It features known creators such as MXR mods and Gopher, I'm not sure who Gopher is, and more. It has more creators in there. This is a highly detailed quest mod that starts off with a courier finding you wherever you are and delivering a winter party invitation. You go to a boat and attend this party. You are met with a robot and the mystery begins there. I have not yet played this mod at the time making this and I intend to make it into a playthrough for Christmas so expect that. The voice acting for the first couple of characters so far is fantastic and it feels like it really belongs in the base game of Skyrim. Check out this mod for yourself, however, it seems great and I really enjoy the detail that's already being put into it. Well guys, I know this video is short, but I hope you enjoyed. I could only find 5 mods for this whole thing. I wanted to add a bunch more, maybe 10 at the least, but I couldn't. I just, you know, I couldn't. I will be releasing a bunch of Let's Plays videos soon, so brace yourselves for that. I have a little, I have a lot to go through. Oh boy. Thank you so much for watching, and if you like this video, click that like button gently. If you didn't, tell me how I could do better. Feedback is always appreciated. And until next time, stay awesome, and have a very Merry Christmas.